<clears throat> Welcome back, guys. We are back, and we're continuing our NBA 2K. Let's play the association mode. Right now, Bird is looking to make a trade. He's looking to get the rookie from Boston, Vitor Favirani. He's looking to get him, who's having a real good... Nine rebounds. He's yeah. looking real good right now. His field goal percentage is good. He's looking to make a big move. Bring him in. Maybe it's going to happen. Let's check it out. And it is accepted. Right off the jump, he has made a big move here. Didn't really lose much. Let's go check him out here. Let's look at his player. I don't player like that Patterson, but I at least got the, the work. Okay, here we go, Raptors. Right now. Oh, and he's on the bench. Oh, God. He's a starter. Oh, I can keep my starter. But so, who's making power? Where's Kevin Love? He's hurt. Kevin Love. And I only have five starters. Right. So, Kev so right now. So what? So oh, I don't shoot right. I uh, traded Shannon Brown. <laughs> right. He did trade Shannon Brown. So, Vucevic is going. He's going to stay a starter. Okay. Richard Jefferson is your small forward. I may put him. On the bench. I don't know. Put Jefferson on the bench and start. Uh, yeah, because when 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 Kevin Love comes Jones. back. No, when Love, yeah, because yeah, he'll be a power. So, but oh, bench player, uh, bench role warm. player. Yeah, he's probably pissed. Yep, yeah, probably. But he's here's the, here's the thing about this though: is whenever you do this, and you then you were taking back down, he's gonna be angry. If you leave him at sixth man, he'll keep stay happy, and they'll probably start him anyway. So, if you move him to a starter, and then later on when Kevin Love comes back. No, look, if he had a role player at four out of five. Right. And then I, and I need a shooting guard to start. Right. That my point here is that if you add another starter, when Love comes back. The play put it out. Oh, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Actually, you're right. Okay, so who's going to starter? Uh, Ross? Terrence, Terrence Ross. Terrence Ross has moved into the starting lineup. You need a sixth man, sir. Uh, Courtney Lee? Let's see, who's all on my bench? <laughs> no, no, more than crap. You got Courtney Lee, so make it Courtney Lee. Courtney Lee is moving over to six man. We're at the All Star break, and we just saw a pretty big deal. No contract extensions at this time. Okay, so uh, we're pretty much there. Oh, we're at the All-Star Festivities. Would you like to participate? The answer is yes. Yes, sir. Okay, we have the rookie game in which we'll be simulating. And we're two weeks left until the player signing deadline. Okay, we're going to go ahead and simulate this. Who? Dion yeah. Waiters is the MVP of this rookie game. Harrison Barnes had a big game. Ben McLemore had a big game for the elites. But they lose. They indeed, Ferrani with a big game. He had a terrible field goal shoot. <clears throat> He's 48%. Uh, he just had. And uh, Michael Carter Williams did not have that good of a game. But no, he, I was talking about for the, that game. He said. Yeah. Who is this antic guy? He's been hooping over there in Atlanta. He's undrafted. He's, thir he's 31 years old. He's a rookie? Yep. He must be overseas. Yep. He's from Fyro. Deion Waiters with 30 points pulled in the MVP. <clears throat> We're at the three-point contest here, which we don't have anybody in there. No, sir. Three-point contest winner is Carmelo. Slam dunk contest, Terrence Ross, the Raptor, is going to try to do this thing. So well, you're going to get to see it right here. Terrence Ross. You're going to watch me probably fail. He is going to fail horribly. And we're going to watch it right here. Who knows? I'm Terrence here. Ross. Blake Griffin is my pick. I think no doubt about it. Blake Griffin's taking this thing. Here Let's goes, go for it, baby. Here goes Bird trying to do something in the dunk contest. He's called the Bird Man for a reason. Gotcha. <laughs> do you think it's because he can jump? I can't. I have no versatility. What's so freaking out? Say that. Right. No, what the a lot of the players on his team can. Kevin Love, Terrence Ross. 
Mm. All right, here we go. All Star 2014, the dunk contest. We are going to see the entrance here momentarily, I believe. There's the entrance. There, you see, we got a pretty good squad there. Blake Griffin's got to be considered the favorite. But then again, Terrence Ross has really been putting up, putting in some work. I just don't personally see it happening for Terrence Ross because Birdman because Birdman's controlling him, and I think that's the problem. So <laughs> we will find out. And Terrence Ross is up first. Okay. Here goes here goes the bird. Um, this one's easy. I'm thinking He's gonna go with something easy to start off. There he goes. It's like a tar hero. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, he jacked it up. Looking sorry as could be. He already is sorry as could be. Here. What are you doing? Odd is Jeremy Evans. So what? You don't think we're recording this too? I know. You don't think we want to see record the whole thing for the fans, bud? And that was a beautiful dunk. Look at him. Look at the beauty. Between the legs. Isaiah Ryder like. That looked good. And he takes it. And he looked pretty good. He got a dunk score of 69. 69, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, the bird doesn't realize we're recording a show here. He wants to just skip through everything. Jared Cunningham is up next. He looks sad. He does look sad. <laughs> I'm close. <laughs> he looks nervous as could be. Are you going to dunk something, Jared Cunningham, or what? I think of what I'm about to do. <laughs> He's thinking for quite some time. <laughs> he is too nervous. Ooh. Not bad. See the replay. See him going 360. Eyes covered. That was nice. That was real nice. Oh my eyes, I can't let the fans I can't see, see nothing. I can't look. I don't know if I would have hit it. My fans would be too scared. That's pretty funny. 74. He got a 74. He got a higher score. He lost his smile. And comes Blake Griffin, the man. They gotta be considered the favorite. The only real superstar in this contest this year. And there goes Blake. <laughs> and Blake did it big. Look at him. He throws it up, lobs it, grabs it, and he brought it down to his ankles. He brought it down to his ankles. Brought it back up, and there it is. That's pretty hard for a big man to do. Think about that, going all the way down to his ankles. And he gets a 74. I believe Terrence Ross coming up next. As you can see, Blake Griffin and Jared Cunningham, pretty close, pretty close. Hey, look at... Uh, Terrence Ross is down there with a zero. He is doing pretty good this game. What? He's doing good this contest. Mean game, but it was a game. Here comes Terrence Ross. Oh, I've got to see if he gets this. He's not smiling too much either. No, because he sucks. <laughs> and he's trying for the same dunk. They already knew it this time. Right. And he goes up. And he nails it. Nails the reverse. Figured it out, ladies and gentlemen. Well, that's just great. Yeah, the dunk. He nailed the dunk. This is probably just going to be cracking. I'm probably not going to win this at all. So. No, you're probably not. This is the first one. Probably not. He's yeah. got a, he got a 19, ladies and gentlemen. What? He got a big 19. Here comes Jeremy. <laughs> I messed up. I finally get one and I get a 19. It's a little, little piece of shit dunk. You use the easiest one out there, you're probably gonna suck with it. Right. And he looks he looks like he's getting ready. Here we go. Here we go. Jeremy Evans. Try to send him. Ooh! <laughs> that was the dunk of the night, no question. He lobs it. He goes up. He picks it up 360 between the legs. It don't get no better than that. It's a half sixty, I don't know exactly. Ooh. 
Ooh, that was nice. It's got to be up there. Got to be. Yep, 81. Dunk of the night. Here comes Jared Cunningham. The guy who doesn't have lost a smile. He, his smile definitely does look lost, but I think he can gain it back here. He's got some confidence. Ooh, the double pump after catching the lob. That should pretty much not be worth much more than 60. Maybe not even more than 50. Not even more than five. It's a typical dunk. Not more than five. It was just a typical dunk. I'd give him a five. And he got a 67. Got a 67 for Jared Cunningham. Here comes Blake Griffin. He don't want to be eliminated. He better get his shit together. He, need, he, he needs to pull another. He needs to pull another 70 here. He needs to pull at least another 70. Ooh, that was not gonna do it. I think he'll get a 60. That was basically just a lob and. Wait. He did what? He just do what I did? No, you didn't lob no damn ball. And you. Didn't turn no, around. That, right, you didn't turn around. You just did a reverse dunk. And he pulls in a 78 on the scale. Blake Griffin's got to be in the lead right now. He is with 153. Jeremy Evans with 151. Terrence Ross sucks. 13. After two rounds. Here we go. We're going to move into the next round. Here comes Terrence Ross. Can he do anything a little bit better? No. Probably not. He, what's he going to do? How do I switch him? Windmills, sideways, one-handed, one smack. Two-handed hesitation. The old switch where we want the cup. The old switch roo. Let's see what he can do here. All right. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, <laughs> you lose, buddy. He put up a good fight, though. Kind of. Total of what? 19 points overall? <laughs> right. <laughs> right, he is doing his faggotry. Jeremy Evans, here he goes. Jeremy Evans has been clowning. Oh, that was that's not going to do it. That's not, that's not big enough. I just don't think that's big enough right there. Unless there's something I'm missing. I mean, the no-look dunk, I mean, that's pretty nice. The no look, but I, I, I mean that no look is pretty nice. I don't see how that could be more than 65. Hit it on the head. Wow. That's right. There you go. That's right. Here comes Cunningham. The leader. A lot more, a lot more, a lot more confidence going on. Another lob. We're seeing a lot of lobs right now. Nah, you know I'm not gonna really roll with that. It wasn't bad. But I also don't think that's more than a 65. The one hand thing, I don't know, that's probably a 70. That one hand, you know, and then... Oh, yeah, and then twisting it back around, that's a 70 at least. Maybe even a 75. Now that I look at it again, that's pretty nice. No, they only got a 60. Blake Griffin looks like he's got this thing. All Blake Griffin needs to really probably do is pull a 70 out right here. And he's probably got this. Then he would be able to say he won two and tied Nate Robinson's two. Here goes Blake. Here goes Blake Griffin. Woo! Not bad for a big man. He'll probably that'll probably be a 70, 72. Look at the reverse. Look at him switch. Ooh. Not bad at all. Look at that. Switching him up. Ooh. That was nice. Blake Griffin gets a 75. And that should do it. Blake Griffin should be this year's champ. Yep. By yep, there's the champ. Blake Griffin is your champ. Since none of us are coaches of the year so far, none of us can coach the All-Star game. Uh, that's typically the way we'll do it. If we lead our conference and wins, we'll coach the All-Star game. You see what I'm saying? Since we don't, we're not in the All-Star game. We're nowhere near it. Right. We're at the bottom of the barrel. Blake Griffin, your slam dunk champion. He looks like a 14 year old kid. He does look young, but he is the slam dunk champion. Again. 
Blake Griffin wins the dunk contest. Carmelo wins the slam uh, wins the three point shootout. Deion Waiters wins the rookie rookie game uh, MVP with thirty points. Thirty points. Thirty points. Daniel, get off the fucking dog. Anyways, we're gonna keep it moving. We got we got more to do here. This is not over. We got the All Star game right now. We're gonna go simulate this. Ba Thaddeus Young is healed, ladies and gentlemen. Before the trade deadline. And the computer adjust the rotation. Absolutely. Here comes the All Star game. Let's get it done. Congratulations, 76ers have the gold. One player named to the All Star team. Kings, one player named to the All Star team. Dwayne Wade was MVP. Look at Cousins with a big game in there. The East All-Stars, Wade did it. I probably would have went with Carmelo, but Wade, Wade did it. He looked good. Definitely looked good. Evan, Evan Turner. He didn't shoot at all. He didn't shoot at all. He had a point and two, two rebounds. All right. With that all said, we're going to end the All-Star break. And uh, what we're going to do here is now that well, you know what time it is, the trade can now happen. The trade why can. Do you trade fund? The trade can. Oh, the trade. Oh, I don't know why I want the trade fund. The trade can now happen. Thaddeus Young. And then this Memphis, Memphis pick. And then the Memphis pick. Two. The Kings. The Sacramento Kings. The Queens. Are for DeMarcus the Cousins. And Derek Williams. That is the deal. I think it's players. Too many players. So I'm going to throw him a player just to get him off my team. Aaron Gray. I'm going to give him Aaron Damn. Gray. I'm going to give him Aaron Gray. He can have Aaron Gray. Back. Back. Yes, absolutely. So we'll get the Grizzly pick. That is young. Was just the deal? This was the deal, right? Yeah. Yep. And DeMarcus Cousins is now a 76er. Sixer. Can you believe this shit, ladies and gentlemen? It has been done. It has been done. DeMarcus Cousins, the star. He's there. Spencer Halls is going to start at power forward. As you can see, we got our normal bench rollers. Our sixth man is Allen. I don't really like that whole deal. So Allen is going to go down to a role player. Derek Williams is going to be our sixth man. They have really improved at six. Cousins, Halls, no, Turner. Turner. We got our squad now. Now Thaddeus now Young go. has to go up for. Thaddeus Young is a starter there. Now He's he has to the go. Same. Oh, Nerlens Noel's got to be your starter, right? Yeah, and Thaddeus Young. Okay, who? So who's the starter down here? Randolph, of course. Oh yeah, Thaddeus Young's got to go six man. He's actually going to be traded, so he could. Yeah. All right. All right, so with that all being said, we got that trade done. I wonder if uh, this has changed anybody's minds here. Nope. All right, so we now have a trade in which he... All right, we got some things going on. He's going to try to trade Daddy as young. Let's go see. Being a superstar. See what he can do. He could, uh, he could easily get some of these fine talents out of his big deal with... Um, no, DeMarcus Cousins, the fine talents such as J.J. Redick and Byron Mullins. We can get that Tony Allen deal, but yeah. Paul Millsap. Take out their best players, Jared, Jared Bayless and Tony Allen. Yeah, they could. Yeah, I think that. that. Is that what you're going to go with? Just look through the others. Paul Millsap, you're going to have Chalmers. First round Jazz 2015. Nash and Kelly, there's your Nash. Tobias Harris. They're going to follow. Skola and Copeland. Chauncey and uh, Jabaco. Lynn and Monty Junis. Splitter in the first round pick. First round pick from the Raptors. Um, and Channing Fry. Actually, he's cool, but they won't Right. They ain't good next year. First round from the Thunder. You got some, another. You got Pikovich and. You got Bogan and Sizemore. Martin Gortat. I think that uh, Grizzlies do. All right. Take out their best players. That's good. You're right, Bun. You're right. 
Good luck with that. But then you give them a power forward. Oh, that's, if, I'm glad he thinks that's going to get it for him. He traded DeMarcus Cousins for Tony Allen. <laughs> Don't come over here with my electronics. Go over there somewhere. <laughs> How are you going to come in for me? You're the one that traded DeMarcus Cousins for Tony You're Allen. You're making fun of me. Because you traded DeMarcus Cousins for, for Tony, Tony Allen. Allen. And Jared Bailey. Jared Bayless really adds the deal, baby. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, this is good quality stuff. He's a 78 now. Whoa. He's a 66. I'm a 73. Oh, this is just perfect. Perfect stuff. All right. As you guys can see, it's time to continue forward. So that's what we'll do here. Oh. Uh. Pretty funny stuff. Let's see here. J.J. Reddick for Jason Richardson in my first round pick from the Nets. I'll decline. The Raptors have energy. Yeah. Kevin Love is back. Back and better than ever. We got the win. And Kevin Love course. is hurt again. Oh, my wrist. <laughs> and the, you're about to pass the trade deadline. Yeah. All right. Good. Everybody good? Sure you don't want to trade Rudy Gay away? Yeah, I'm sure. All right. He's your only good guy left, so. All right. We got 76 in the Mavericks. You know, I had a feeling Kevin Love was going to get hurt again. As you can see, I'm getting some wins here since the All-Star break, 2-0. 2 and off for the Kings. Wow. The Kings are looking good. Wow. I'm two and one. All right. Well, Ross has Ross scored 29 on. Yes, he did. He All right. We're getting. Okay. We're getting towards. Now we're going to go ahead and finish up February. And then we'll look everything over before this episode ends. Yeah, do a long game last Oh, yeah. That's right. Orlando. Ah, uh, come on. And we got the 76ers in the Bucks. Raptors in Cleveland. Come on, man. Kevin <laughs> Rockets and the Kings. Come back. Baby, come back. <laughs> <laughs> Richard Jefferson's out. Uh, About to pass the player resigning. We got to stop and look just in case. Evan Turner is still undecided. Well, he at least out he didn't. Well, at least he didn't decide he wanted to test free agency, though. So he may start in the offseason. Yep. You better hope, though, because he's an all-star this year. All right. Kings Lakers. Kings have completed the goal, win five in a row. All right. That trade may have just fucking saved them. They needed defense. That's what it is. They needed defense. Yeah, fuck them. That's what they needed. Raptors still suck. I don't care. 76ers still suck. Good. Look at them dimes. Look at them dimes. Players of the week for Carter Williams. He actually won player of the week and rookie of the month. Noel won rookie of the month, too. Five in a row, getting some wins. And then they lost to Minnesota. Well, they still got five in a row. Five and one the last six yeah, games. Yeah, fuck them. Yeah, they are doing better. And they're overall improved. Yeah, man, what the Oh, yeah, fuck? Zach Randall came back. Ah, oh, shit. Mm -hmm. I ain't got no time for this bullshit. <laughs> I just can't imagine grabbing them boards. It's probably what saved you, Tony Allen's defense and. All right, we're into. All right, so February's over. Shit. Let's see the final. Uh, we'll, look, we'll look at the injury report. Okay, six to eight months. We got. Okay, Conley's out four weeks. DeRozan's out. Memphis is just falling apart. Gallinari's out six weeks. Damn, Memphis is going da out. Dave, Davis from Memphis is out. Yep, Chris Humphreys is out. Mm. Nicholson, six weeks. Yes. Memphis Jonas is, is hurt again. Memphis is getting injured. Stizma is out for the season. Six to eight months for Taylor. Watson's eight weeks. See what's going on there. Let's look at the transaction. It's a final transaction. Orlando Whoa. fired Jacques Vaughn. Hired oh, they Gene hired the, co they had the Hawks coach. Yeah, they did. Let's sign him, baby. Yeah, they did. All right, the trades. Let's see what went on here. 
towards the, at the end of the trade deadline, it was just us making the moves. The big move of the year has to be DeMarcus Cousins coming to Philly. But then again, whose record improved since DeMarcus Cousins left? I'm that not, must I'm mean DeMarcus try- Cousins was a problem for the Kings organization. I'm not trying to win. I'm trying to get Andrew Wiggins. <laughs> you're trying to you're trying to start rigging for Wiggins. Right. I guess. That's what you want to call it. No, hey, that- Durant's averages at over 31 a game. Durant is killing them this year. Rebounds and we got Howard and Bynum. Bynum's getting better. Blake. I don't see any Kevin Love. Ty Lawson's leading the league in assists. Michael Carter Williams is fifth in the league in assists. Steals per game. Michael Carter Williams is third in the league Tony in Allen, steals. Look at, look at Tony Allen. Yeah, he is. Blocks per game. Nobody on our teams now. Let's go check out this three pointers made. Yeah. Steph Curry, of course, of course. You've seen it. Let's look at this rookie report. Yes. And Nakamura moved back up. That's just the rookie report. Now let's go ahead and look. you know what? Since you are that arrogant. Let's look at the award races. Michael Carter Williams. Look who's number two, baby. That's right, baby. Look who's number two, dog. I see it. I see it. Good trade for me. Sixth man of the year, Marcus Thornton's looking uh-huh. good. Defensive player looks like Drummond, maybe. Gerald Most improved, Green. Gerald Green. MVP Carl's LeBron. Boozer. Carlos yeah. Boozer's in the MVP hunt. Can you see that shit? Whoa, look. he's doing good, too. Boozer. Twenty-one and ten. Yeah. Twenty and ten. Clowning. Okay. With that said, we saw the final stats here. Um, we'll be going into the final two months when we come back, ladies and gentlemen. We do have a Sacramento game. In fact, we'll go ahead and simulate up here. We got Sacramento and Toronto coming up. Um, so we will go ahead and simulate up here. See what we got. Seventy-sixers Orlando. New Orleans Sacramento. Sacramento with another win, which is pissing me off. Gay, because Gay had 37. And... They beat the Pelicans. Yes, they did. Yes. There goes Kevin Love back. And we're going to be going to this game as soon as we come back. But in the meantime, we're going to look at our things. And anyway, if you liked the video, hit the, hit the thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, with that being said, we're going to come back and finish off this season when we come back.